today's video is kind of bittersweet for me because it's my last video of 2013 and I'm like, where did this year go? I don't know about you guys, but this year has been so amazing for me and I hope it was for you. I'm really excited about 2013, but it's like, wow, 2013 is over. And But yeah, 2014 should be great and I hope it's a great year for all of us. Um, today's video is a Lush Bath cocktail that was requested by a user on Instagram. I think it, I don't know how to say this, but it's like Simarfania, I don't know how to say that, sorry. Um, and she asked for a New Year's Eve cocktail that would perk you up and get you ready to stay up. Some citrusy or uplifting scents would be good. So that's what I'm kind of going for. I'm also going to put like a, a nighttime theme to it. And I'm really excited about this cocktail and I hope some of you guys can try it out. So I'm going to get started with all the products we're going to be using. First thing is a bath bomb, and it's called the Luxury Lush Pud. Lush, Lush Pud. Um, Lush came out with this this year for the first time. They did have a little Lush Pud that was a lot smaller than this, had a different scent. The only um, similarities is that the name is pretty similar, and the white part in this little holly there, or mistletoe, whatever, um, was also on that bath bomb. But this smells like the, the Twilight Bath Bomb from Lush that they have permanently. So if you do not have this bath bomb, definitely use the Twilight Bath Bomb. It smells like lavender and vanilla. It's really, really nice. Um, I know this isn't a very citrusy scent, and um, uh, it'd probably actually make you want to fall asleep, but the colors in it really reminded me of New Year's Eve, and I thought it'd be really nice in this bath. The next thing we're going to be using is a tiny bit of the Christmas Eve bubble bar. This is one of my favorite bubble bars Lush has. Um, it's another Christmas product. Almost, I think actually all of these are Christmas products, so if you don't have them, I'm sorry. Um, it's one of my favorite products. It's again kind of um, actually makes you feel like sleeping, but don't worry. Hopefully this will be uplifting and citrusy and just kind of remind you of New Year's. This is a great bubble bar, and I absolutely love it. It gives you a ton of bubbles. We're going to be using a tiny bit of the blue part, um, and hopefully it'll make our water kind of a nighttime blue and give us a little bit of bubbles. Um, we're only going to be using probably about a fourth of it or so. Not that much. Um, we just want a little bit of bubbles and a little bit of color. So Okay, so this, I believe, is called the Shooting Stars. I always forget the name of this one for some reason. This is a bath melt, and it's super glittery and totally reminds me of um, New Year's Eve. And it also is very lemony and citrusy, so it will keep you up, hopefully, through the whole night till midnight or till twilight. And it's really pretty and leaves your fingers super glittery as you can see so um, it'll probably stick on your skin because I've heard other people say that I've never actually used this before in the bath you will not need to use this whole thing maybe a half or a third of it uh, these are very very moisturizing and this just moisturizes your skin and very melty it's melting my hands right now my hands are pretty warm but it is melting in my hands it's really really nice very very lemony and hopefully will keep you up till midnight. Look, there's a little blue blob in the middle of shooting stars or whatever this thing is called. Super cool. It's melting, it's falling. Okay. As for a soap, you could really use anything you want. This snow globe soap, which I have wrapped up, um, is very lemony and will definitely keep you up through the night. It's one of my favorites. I absolutely love it. And it's just a really, really good soap if you have that. Also, the Angel's Delight soap here, I also have this one wrapped up, it smells like fruit punch, which is delicious and very New Year's Eve-y, and I really like this soap as well. But I'm probably going to be using today since it isn't actually New Year's Eve um, right now. I have to edit this and hopefully post it by New Year's Eve. I'm going to be using the Twilight Shower Gel. Uh, it's like lavender. It's really relaxing, but um, it does smell really good and kind of goes with the theme of our... Um, bath cocktails. As for a soap, you could really use anything you want. This snow globe soap, which I have wrapped up, um, is very lemony and will definitely keep you up through the night. It's one of my favorites. I absolutely love it. And it's just a really, really good soap if you have that. Also, the Angel's Delight soap here, I also have this one wrapped up, it smells like fruit punch, which is delicious and very New Year's eve -y. And I really like this soap as well. Well, I'm probably going to be using today since it isn't actually New Year's 
Eve um, right now. I have to edit this and hopefully post it by New Year's Eve. I'm going to be using the Twilight Shower Gel, um, which is kind of the theme since the name of this cocktail is Staying Up, uh, Let's Stay Up, hmm, whatever. So um, this is what I'm going to be using today. It just smells like lavender. It's really relaxing, but um, it does smell really good and kind of goes with the theme of our um, bath cocktail. So that is why I'm using that. It smells a lot like our bath bomb we're using. Okay, so let's finally, finally get everything ready and then get in our bath. Yay! So as you can see, we did not use that much of the Christmas Eve bubble bar, and it did give us quite a bit of bubbles, so that's exciting. Um, and it's not like super scented, which is a good thing, because this is really relaxing, and we want to stay up, right? Yeah. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is put in the Luxury Lush Pud, which is kind of like fireworks. So yeah, I'm going to kind of push the bubbles over and put this in. I have never used this bath bomb before. Okay, so this is crazy, and it is like fireworks. I knew it would be. A pretty fast fizzer, I would say. It's not slow, but it's not like super quick that it just is gone in a second. You can see all the pretty colors. It is actually pretty fast. That's all that's left. What happened? It's so beautiful, you guys. Very colorful, and definitely like New Year's Eve. Just very, very colorful. And smells amazing. It smells really nice. You can see the different colors. Now I'm going to add this little bit of bath melt that I have in here. Very, very citrusy scented. It's just probably going to melt away there for a little bit. Guys, do you see how pretty this is? This is such a beautiful bath. I feel like in every bath cocktail I do, I say it's even prettier than the other one, but oh my gosh, you guys. And I can do this one again because I have left over basically everything. So you can see all the sparkles like went out of the bath melt and they're kind of all throughout the bath, but you can't really see on camera. It's so moisturizing, oh my gosh. With just that little bit, and you can see the blue kind of dissolved. I'm guessing that's just more bath melt, but it's just a blue glittery thing. It's so pretty. I'm going to kind of mix it. Oh, it looks more red on camera, but it's kind of like a purpley, gorgeous, kind of like a fruit punch thing. And I realized earlier today, <laughs> or I realized <laughs> like halfway through that this is a bath cocktail and some people drink cocktails on New Year's Eve. <laughs> so funny. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. I didn't get that much footage of the bath bomb dissolving, but first of all, it was a really quick fizzer, and second of all, my camera, like, died in the middle because there was too much memory on it, so I need to go do that super quick, but yeah, that's what happened if you're wondering why there wasn't that much bath bomb footage, but I just want you guys to look how pretty this color it is. Um, it is such a pretty color. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's like a big bath of fruit punch and smells like lavender and like lemon it really does smell amazing and oh my gosh you guys if you haven't entered my giveaway definitely go enter it um, I did make one mistake because I didn't know YouTube didn't do video responses anymore so instead of doing a video response you may comment once on the video and I will choose a winner um, so yeah, go do that. And remember, you cannot ever have a bath without a rubber ducky, so let's choose from the rubber ducky family. I hope you all have a fantastic new year, and um, yeah, I hope you had a great year this year. I had an amazing one. Thank you all so much. I really hope you guys can try this cocktail because it is amazing. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Enter my giveaway if you haven't already. And yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in 2014. Bye.